So why were you free? I mean, do you know why you were? Yes. I think, um, interestingly, that was, that was a phase uh, for China uh, where they were trying to regain, where they, there was a need for them to show that they are more liberal now and uh, they need uh, Western support. That was the time, we are talking about 1997. 1997 was the year when Hong Kong came back to uh, China. 1997, after uh, Tibet protests of uh, 1980s, uh, 89, the Tiananmen Square, uh, 89, the Nobel Peace Prize, 1991, the collapse of the Soviet Union, uh, reunification of Germany. There was a lot of pressure on China to be liberal. So that was the time when China needed a lot of ambassadors for them and they were very, very short of them. So I think um, they thought that if I was sent back and if I tell my stories of being released from, uh, from prison, they thought that I could be a good ambassador. Yes. Uh, which I know that they are now regretting hugely. <laughs> 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 Big mistake. <laughs> Big mistake. You should have killed me. <laughs> uh, I think. So I think I'm saying this because a uh, little before my release, uh, they took me on a tour, a Lhasa tour, from the prison. They t uh, one day they said, oh, we are taking you uh, for a tour, Lhasa tour. I, of course, I didn't believe. I never believed anything that they were saying because all the time they were, they were lying. Mm -hmm. They would say that we are going at 4 o'clock, they never come and they come the next day and they suddenly shock you by taking you for a... Uh, interrogation session and mm. it was very very uh, difficult moment uh, so um, when they took me for this Lhasa tour in a jeep um, they took me to the what is called overseas uh, shopping center so there were many Tibetans from Nepal and India who were selling trinkets and um, jewelry and a lot of other stuff I saw Hindi film uh, actor actresses posters in, in those. It was huge relief for me to see these in uh, Hindi uh, cinema actor and actresses, uh, their photographs of a long time. Um, then they took me to uh, Parkour, they took me to Potala, they took me to see the Bank of China and um, Radio Lhasa uh, and the roads and all the time said, you know, the, they kept, kept reminding me of the metals road and said, look at the road. Do you do you not understand how much development we have brought to Tibet? Mm -hmm. um, at the end, at the end of that uh, that uh, day's uh, tour, uh, in the prison they uh, brought a camera, video camera, and they made me sit in front of the camera and uh, interviewed me. So they asked um, like this, said, um, now having toured Lhasa and having come to Lhasa, what is your impression? Is that, I've been here for three months, all the time I've seen only that uh, prison cell. So I didn't see much of Lhasa, I cannot really comment, you know, I'm not a Lhasa expert. Uh, then they said, oh, did you not see the development in Lhasa? I said, I saw the Potala, which, which I think is a little smaller than I imagined. <laughs> um, really, you know, when I, when I was taken into Lhasa by, in, in that police car, when we first arrived and you know kind of we kind of zipped in front of the potala it must have been my boy romance of La potala i always thought that potala was a mountain size it actually looked smaller than <laughs> than i imagined so um so i was basically saying yes i saw the potala and saw the market and saw things like that but um I, so I most of the time I spent my time in in Nasa, in the in the, in the jail. So they asked, uh, how was your experience in jail? <laughs> well, most of the time I was hungry. Um, and they asked, uh, well, did anybody beat you? I said, no, nobody beat me. Um, and which was true. I was not beaten by anybody in in Nasa jail. I was beaten up in Mari detention camp. Uh, I think, therefore, they were already calculating that I'm, since I'm origin, origin, originated from India, therefore I'm supposed to be Indian citizen. So I should be sent back with no marks of torture on my body, which was very clear uh, for them right from the beginning when I was being beaten in uh, during the 
interrogation sessions in uh, Nuri town. They, they were slapping me, boxing, kicking, um, threatening to torture me with red hot iron um, rods. But they were making sure that there was no mark left on me. Thank you.